Hello, my name is Chris Copeland and welcome to the Outlook Express message rule tutorial. I've prepared this just so that you can um, get your emails sort of uh, protected there and as you can see this is a live tutorial and what we've got there is we've just had a, an email come in from me taking away the one that I prepared. Anyway, what we've got is that uh, if you look over here in my folders box you'll see that I've already prepared um, a folder called auto saved emails which has nothing in it at the moment and uh, if you look below that you'll see that I have prepared a folder called DIY compost uh, emails these are easy to create you just go into file folder new select the folder name one which I called auto saved emails and I saved it in my inbox and you click OK and that's it created. Um, same with the other folder, just create that one inside the auto saved emails folder. Now what we're going to do is go back to my inbox, click on the message that I'm looking to save and we're going to create a message rule for that. Create rule from message. When the new mail rule box comes up you'll see that it wants you to select your conditions for your rule um, where the from line contains people in this case where the from line contains support at DIYcompost.com you can be more specific as you flick through this little menu here you can select whichever one is relevant to you and uh, tick the relevant box in the second box select the actions for your rule I prefer to actually copy it to the folder that way it comes in, I get a copy, and even if I accidentally dump something in my inbox, it means that I've actually still got a copy, which I find much, much better and more organised. Anyway, the Outlook Express does not know what folder to put it in yet, so we have to tell it. If you go down to the third rule description, it says a specified folder, and we click on that. It wants to copy to the DIY compost emails, within the auto saved emails box. See that? Uh, just ignore the auto saved emails box that I've got above that. That's the one I use personally for saving my auto saved emails, uh, which helps me with the organization. Okay, so we've done that and we're okay with that. As you can see, the Outlook Express now knows to copy it to the DIY compost emails folder, which is fairly simple. If we click OK, oh, it tells us now that the rule was successfully added and that's your job done. All messages now that come in from support at DIY Compost will be deposited into the DIY Compost emails folder. However, we're still left with the first message in the inbox, so I suggest that you just click on that, carry it over and drop it into the DIY Compost emails folder. Then you have that. Now, if you're getting the e-zines and you save them up in a folder like this using this method, it means that you can actually look back and check everything, follow it through, and that'll help you with your organization. Okay, I hope this helps you to get organized, and I look forward to the next time I speak to you. Thank you. Bye-bye.